Hi, class 80 students. Look at page number 12 of your English textbook. Today we are going to read from unit 2 A Visit to Godavari. Dear students, have you ever visited Godavari? If you have not visited that place, you will know all the information about Godavari from this chapter. You know, it is very famous for picnic sport and botanical garden. Okay, let's read from the text. Grade 8 students of Harga Lakshmi School went for a visit to Godavari in Lalitpur district. They studied about many plants there and enjoyed its scenic beauty. When they returned to school, Sirjana, the leader of the visiting team, answered the questions asked by the students who were unable to attend the trip. Some students of Kharga Lakshmi School had gone for a visit to Godavari. They studied plants of that place and also enjoyed a lot of scenic beauty. But some students were unable to attend the trip. So, those who did not attend the trip asked some questions to Sirjana, the leader of the visiting team, about Godavari. Okay, here is one student, Binod, who was absent in the trip, asked first question to Sirjana. Tell us something interesting about Godavari. Sirjana answers, Godavari is a beautiful place situated at the base of a hill full of exotic and local plants varieties. Very strange, exotic means strange and local plants varieties. The fern and the orchid houses are very popular. The Japanese garden which is in the northwestern part of the area is also a sight to see. This lost region, lost region means place which is full of green grass, is the home of many plants. There are four types of oak trees, a kind of tree with their leaves remaining green all the year round. In Edison, rhododendrons, wild walnuts, dark chestnuts and Himalayan maples are other species found in this garden as its climate is subtropical. Subtropical means warm. More than 520 species of butterflies and plants are found in Godavari. Okay. And what are the interesting things? Let's see here. The interesting things are like this. Um, the Godavari is Godavari is full of full of exotic and local plants varieties. Okay, here here you can see the four nine orchid houses, the Japanese garden, and uh, oak trees. Rhododendrons, wild walnuts, dark chestnuts, Himalayan maples, and uh, 529 species of butterflies and plants have made Godavari very beautiful. These are the things, interesting things, said by Sirjana. Okay, let's see here. Mamata, here is another student, Mamata who asked question to Sirjana. Question is, did you have to write about what you observed in Godavari? What you have seen in Godavari, did you have to write any report? Okay, Sirjana answered, yes, of course. We were asked to write a short report on Godavari's butterflies and animals in April and May butterflies many of them with 
with gleaming shallow tails. We can, sometimes we see butterfly with uh, gleaming tails or glowing tails. Sometimes we see. And a flock around means gathered together around beautiful flowers. Godauri is a shelter for over center for over a hundred species of butterflies ranging from drab beaks drab beaks means a kind of butterfly to blue peacocks this is also a kind of butterflies this sort of butterflies could be seen in that place here is written hundred species of butterflies okay so um, uh, she replied, uh, yes, she had to write a short report. She had to write a short report on butterflies and animals. Butterflies in April and May gathered together around flowers. Godauri is the dwelling place of hundred kinds of butterflies, hundred species of butterflies. This way, Sirjana answered uh, to the question of Mamata. Okay, dear student, here is another student, Anuj, who also was absent in the trip to Godavari. The question is like this. I have heard Godavari is a famous picnic spot as well as, is it true? Okay, Godavari is a famous picnic spot, is it true? Okay, this question was asked by Anuj. Okay, Sizana answers here. That's right. Godauri's beauty and plants attracts many people who go there to enjoy a picnic, especially on Saturdays. Large groups of people gather there for cookouts. Varieties of food items are prepared and served uh, in paper or leaf place because they are biodegradable, discomposable. Picnics are often associated or linked with festivals and are a long-standing tradition in Nepal. Picnics have been part of the social harmony for centuries. People enjoy eating, participate in dancing, singing, and other fun events at picnics. Okay, dear students, according to Sirjana, the people who go there to enjoy picnic, definitely they are attracted by its natural beauty and plants. People, especially on Saturdays, gather there to cook and they serve their food on paper place since paper place are biodegradable, discomposable. They take picnics as a festival and also have been part of the social harmony. Besides cooking and eating, they participate in dancing, singing, and organize fun events. Okay, here is another question asked by Asa. Question is like this. How can we reach there from Kathmandu? Sijana answers like this. Godauri is within each reach of Kathmandu's ring road. You can take a public vehicle, minibus, microbus or private car or taxi to go to there. Okay, so there are many facilities, vehicle transport facilities. Okay, here is another question asked by Asa. How can we reach there from Kathmandu? Sijana answers like this, Godauri is within easy reach of Kathmandu's ring road. You can take a, a public vehicle, minibus, microbus or private car or taxi to go there. Okay. She says, Godauri is not far from 
Godavari is not far from Kathmandu and uh, you can go there by public vehicle, minibus, microbus or private car or taxi. This way she has answer to Asa. Okay, let's read another question asked by Anil. How would you appeal people? How would you request people to visit Godavari? Okay, she says like this. Well, visiting places like Godavari provides us with recreation and uh, inspiration to study nature. We are nature lover and it is part of our lives in this sense godavari is worth visiting okay she says godavari is the place for recreation and and inspiration to study nature moreover we are nature lovers so the place is very worth visiting for us hope you have understood now let's do the exercise of this lesson first of all let's look here match the words with their meanings okay so exotic orchid loss subtropical gleaming drab okay this side these words are given here and on the another side warm temperature dull and boring stand and unusual and exciting uh, covered in healthy grass and plants, a kind of flowers, sungaba, paint in light. Okay, so you have to match um, this this words and meaning. So first of all, exotic. Look here, what is exotic? What is exotic here? Okay, here I have written here, uh, strange or unusual and exciting. Okay, uh, B number orchid. Orchid, let's look this side. B number. Okay, B number here. A kind of flower in the bracket, Sungava. Okay, look at this C number, loss. And where is C? Okay, you see number, uh, loss. Covered in healthy grass and plants. And let's see D number, soft topical, soft topical, D number here look here where is D and warm temperature subtropical means warm temperature similarly gleaming gleaming E number where is here uh, faint in light faint in light similarly drab drab F number where is drab means dull and boring okay this way we have matched it, matched it and you have to write in your uh, exercise copy please look at number two fill in the blanks with the correct words from the text okay uh, Sijana is the leader of the leader of the you can see here visiting team yes should be yes should be visiting okay Godavari is situated at the at the base 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 of the for uh, forested hills okay number number C the leaves of oak trees uh, leaves of oak trees here you can see remain remain green all the year around uh, number D butterflies look here butterflies flock flock around beautiful uh, flowers number e uh, picnic are often you can see here uh, associated associated uh, with festivals okay okay we are doing answers the following questions okay number a what makes godavari beautiful okay look at it Look at here. You have to write in your copy. Uh, exotic local varieties of plants, fern, and orchid houses, Japanese gardens, 
लॉस रीजन्स ओक ट्रीज बटरफ्लाइज पिकनिक स्पॉट्स मेक गोदावरी ब्यूटिफुल ओके नंबर टू बी नंबर व्हाट इज गोदावरी फेमस फॉर गोदावरी इज फेमस फॉर नेचुरल ब्यूटीज पिकनिक स्पॉट्स फाइव हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी नाइन वेराइटीज ऑफ द बटरफ्लाइज ओके नंबर सी हाउ मेनी स्पेसिज ऑफ प्लांट्स आर फाउंड देयर ओके देर आर अबाउट फाइव हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी नाइन स्पेसिज ऑफ प्लांट्स आर फाउंड देयर ओके नंबर डी इन वेस्ट मंथ डू वी फाइन बटरफ्लाइज uh we can see here uh we we find uh, butterflies moving around moving around flowers in godavari in the months of in the months of uh april and may okay now mari how can picnics be part of social harmony picnic can be a part of social harmony harmony because people in all races regions and ethnic group gather together to enjoy the picnic by eating singing and dancing okay f number what do people do in picnics apart from um, eating okay apart look here apart from eating they sing they sing dance and enjoy every moment okay uh we have completed uh, exercises also all of you need to write in your copy okay this much for today see you next time